So stay tuned for this part of the show. <laughs> I guess that's what we're doing now. Yeah. <laughs> hey, we're Bucko. This is my best friend Lauren. This is my best friend Aaron. And today we're going to share with you a new member of our Bucko family. She is bringing to the table a lot, a wealth of knowledge. And She's also this. bringing sexy back. Yep. So we had many different names picked out, but this is the one that stuck. What were some of the names that we didn't know? Let's just introduce her. This is Ruby, everyone. Say hi to Ruby. Hi, Ruby. Ruby is eight weeks old today, right? Yep. Is it today? Yep. And she is our new member of the family, and she's awesome. She's Halfway to potty training already? Yeah, we she's assume. very smart, right? We might be just those people who have dogs and take them in their bags shopping and things. We're not. We're trying to get her socialized because my good friend Tiffany handles a lot of dogs. And she was saying that a lot of times people have this misconception that you're not supposed to introduce your dogs to different environments and different types of things and people and sounds until after they're five months old. But that can actually be a problem because... Sometimes by then they're like set in their ways and they're like, nope, I don't like any of those things and too bad, so sad. I'm going to bark and yell at everything I see that isn't in my immediate home. So we're trying to get her used to like going in the car or, um, <laughs> uh, you know, hair dryers and. Yeah, because we have to take her different people places. People with hats and people with glasses. And she's, this is her size as a baby. She's going to get to about a shih tzu size. Yeah. yeah. Is that right? Yeah. About that size. So why are you fascinated over here? What is it over here? Things smell good. Things smell apparently. good. Apparently. Oh, watch your bum. So, um, yeah, we wanted to introduce her because she is going to be in a lot of things from now on. She's going to be around, yep. kicking it. And if you haven't known already, you could have known by following us on Instagram. So it's just Buck of Comedy on Instagram, correct? Yep. Yeah. So, right? Right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh-huh. So, yeah, maybe yeah. she'll play. Yep. She, she likes... Is a very, she's very, she likes this ball. She likes Found this out yesterday because she came home yesterday. Hi. Hey, Ruby. What's that? Oh. oh my god. I don't know if Dave sees this. Probably not. The main camera does. The main camera sees it. So we wanted to ask you, what was your favorite pet? Or do you have a pet? We we like to know. Like what is your pet's name? Where did you get that name? Why do you like that name? Was it a dog? Was it a cat? Was it a lizard? Was it a parrot? Was it a fish? Yep. Yeah. A lot of people had fish as their first pet and only pet because their parents were like, no pets. Yeah, that's um, true. A lot of parents, I think. I had a fish, and that was me particularly to take care of them for responsibility. We had a dog named Clyde, but I had fish. I had two. They were Nellie and Abraham. And I had a cat and a dog, Gus. And I grew up with Gus, and then we got Tammy when I was about eight, I'm assuming. Mm -hmm. And she was a great dog. Yep. She was already trained. She was, I think she was a show dog. And then she went to this horrible, not horrible family, but this family that's like, yeah, <laughs> like, let's go to, let's go to the States and shop. <laughs> and they didn't take care of her. Yeah, we did. No, no, you did, oh. but that family didn't. They, no, they took care of her. It's just they had a, they ended up having a toddler oh. and that she snipped out. Was not a fan of yeah. the toddler. Yeah. yeah, we, we had a big dog growing up and then we got a little dog when I was about a little 10 or 11 named Maddie, and she was a Shih Tzu Bichon. And she lived till she was 17, and she was a very happy, healthy baby. So if you want to see Ruby, there she is. Ruby, mm -hmm. the awesome puppy. Hi, how are you doing? You doing good? Mm -hmm. You are the cutest thing ever, did you know that? Hi. Everyone's like, you guys are just staring at your dog instead of talking. <laughs> hey. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> hey, that's when she wants to wrestle. Yeah. She wants to wrestle me. Hey, okay. Want to wrestle? With that ball, don't you? Let's do it. Let's do it. She also really likes this set. She wants to chew. She wants to chew everything on the set. Yeah. So, <laughs> we're ready to do a brand new set. Um, but yeah, we want to know what you think about animals and um, what your favorite one was. Uh, I didn't grow up with cats. I don't dislike them, but they weren't my family's jam. But some people love cats. I would never ever do a bad thing to a cat. Some people hate cats. I like them. Just never really owned one myself. Um, I think it's interesting when people have exotic pets. Yeah, it is weird. Yeah. I'm working on a show right now where there is a, a parrot. That's a carrot, a character in the... Uh, is the name Carrot? No. Although, mm -hmm. that would be a great name. But it's a character in oh. the show. And 
she really likes peanuts. That's her snack of choice. I didn't know parrots like peanuts, but she does. There you go. Yeah. Or do you have even a wilder kind of animal like a Ikea monkey? Mm. Remember with Ikea little, monkey? Yeah, with the little jacket. The Toronto Ikea Show monkey. Show the Ikea monkey right here. Show the Ikea with monkey. the little fur coat. Some weird, Was it, it, it was an Asian couple, right? That had like... Was it a... Yeah, I don't know. Or a Hispanic couple? I can't remember. doesn't really but matter. they're not the legal general... to own in Canada as a pet. No, they aren't. And it got out of the lady's car. And it was wearing this yellow coat. No, was... it was like a little Russian doll jacket. Like, yeah. it was fuzzy. <laughs> but it was a yellow... Oh. But it was yellow. Some things we're learning is that you have to... Uh, when they bite you a little bit harder than they should, you have to yelp. So like they, it hurts. Like it hurts. And then what else? Taking them pee. Yeah. In the outside in the cold in Manitoba. She looks at us uh, like we are from Mars. Like, do yeah. you want me to what? I yeah. now understand that it's a certain part of parenting mm. where you're like, Oh, I've gotta be evil for the sake of good. Mm. I've gotta go against my instincts of nurturing. I had to do that this morning. Because they're not doing something they shouldn't be doing. So it's we'll we'll have some I'm sure we'll have a lot of stories in that vein. I thought she hated me forever because I got I had to be tough, tough dog mom and say, no, you're not allowed to chew up your pee pad. And I put her in the corner. No one puts baby in the corner. No, no one. Puts, puts Ruby in the corner. No one puts Ruby in Except the corner. Except for me when she's tearing up her pee pad. Ruby! Ruby! Uh-oh. I wish you could see this, Dave. I, we should we should have made this so there's a panable mm -hmm. thing where or you can up, see. Or up camera. Maybe I'll give you some footage of her playing with the ball because it is adorable. Yep. And you can put it out. Because we went for Ow! four weeks. Was it four weeks? We went uh, and visited? Uh, no, almost seven. Seven weeks. Yeah. Oh, that's right. Seven yeah. weeks. We're, yeah, almost eight, right? Yeah. yeah. We got her on the eighth week. So Yeah. She was born on Thanksgiving. Mm -hmm. She's a little turkey. Mm -hmm. And uh, she then came home with us yesterday. Mm hmm and so we're very excited because we have pictures of it. So we'll give some of those to Dave and Dave can make a little bit of a collage. Bother you that there is puppies on the couch? Is that what you're trying to tell me? You don't like that there's puppies on here. You don't like that there's puppies on this cup. I don't. You don't like that there's puppies on this cup. Okay, noted. Ruby, 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 Ruby! But she's probably the smallest in her litter. She is. She is not a runt, which we learned is not a nice yeah, name. Yeah, don't don't, don't say that it. to a breeder uh, no. of any kind. No. They do or not like the term runt. Anyone really that deals with dogs on a regular, don't call them that. And for those of you who are asking, did we adopt her or did we get it from a breeder? We got it from a breeder, and here's the only reason why. Erin has finicky allergies. I am all for adopting shelter dogs, and I would do that in a heartbeat if it weren't for the fact that we basically wouldn't be able to have a dog unless we got a specific breed that didn't irritate his allergies. So that's why we have donated a lot of time to the Winnipeg Humane Society. So people who are going, man, don't, don't chop, blah, blah, blah. I get you. I'm all for it. But this is the way we wanted to take care of a baby. Yeah. So. And I had animals growing up and I don't know, 23, something happened where all my allergies went, mm -hmm. 
Yep. So pollens and everything. But we're going to be doing some cool stuff with the uh, Winnipeg Humane Society in the new year. So make yeah, sure you check that out. Absolutely. Trust me, you're going to want to watch that. We have a video that's in the works. Yeah. Well, it's like finished. We just have to edit it. Yeah, you're going to want to watch that. It's so. going to be good. We uh, This feels like a little bit of a chill show because the star is taking the spotlight and yeah, our attention. And our attention. We're totally distracted by our amazing puppy. Yep. Which will just feed pictures and video over top of our voices. So... Mm -hmm. You can just enjoy the puppy as well. <laughs> well yeah. Yeah. But that's pretty much it. Let's uh, sign off by getting really close. Okay. Come over here, Lauren. Come on this side. Is Lauren in shot? Yeah. Thanks everyone for watching. We are Bucko. This is our best friend, Lauren. This is my best friend, Aaron. And this, this is, is our, our new, new friend, friend, Ruby. Uh, please subscribe to our channel and check out other videos and stuff because she's amazing and we're amazing. So okay. we need you. Okay. Bye. 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 Thank <laughs> you.